when we started this garden, like it was completely overgrown. It took us like a week to to chop everything down and like plant the beds, get the rows right. It became easy. Things started to the, the load started to lighten itself. I always liked to get my hands dirty, but it was kind of more fun to learn like how to plant food, what can, what can I grow, how can I grow it, to see it grow, to put the time in and watch it grow. You did the whole work, so you feel the whole joy of when you get to eat it or when you get to give it to someone, like you can say, oh, I did that. Or like, oh, that looks good. I grew it, it came from me, you know what I mean? I put in the time. I was involved with Youth Farm for about 13 years. It's been probably one of the most formative things in my life. It's been one of the most important things in my life. But Youth Farm's more than just like a gardening program. It's a tool for social change. The garden is merely this like, this, this starter point for so many other great things. I've been involved with Youth Farm for about 14, 15 years. It's that Youth Farm, we care a lot about those youth who don't have the same resources as, as the other, you know. We want to to kind of help them with the systems that there are. And, and so I think that little by little, you know, we can approach to those youth who really need this kind of program. Since I've been at Youth Farm for so many years, uh, I noticed many things have changed. We had a like eight week summer program and I was in South Minneapolis Youth Farm. We had like 80 kids signed up for the summer uh, with like 15 staff work in the summer with the youth. We no longer have the traditional summer program model and we no longer work in South Minneapolis. We primarily work in North Side Minneapolis and then um, St. Paul. And, and I think that's changed because it's been a way like we are listening to what people in the community are saying and what people say they need. It highlights Youth Farm's ability to really critically look at itself and make sure that their work continues to align with their mission. So I think the progressive model at Youth Farm really is effective. I am an example of that. I've been part of Youth Farm since I was nine. Then when I went to high school and I took the job, I was part of the lead staff program, which are our high school students. A Youth Farm lead is a staff member of Youth Farm, but it's like a beginner. It really helped with learning job skills. I also met a lot of really great people and some people from programs of Youth Farm that were in different parts of the city than me and learning about like how they did program there and how I did program in this neighborhood in Parktown. First I started as a, a farm steward educating youth and just trying to get them on the right track and now this October 1st I'll be a program specialist trying to like guide them in a, a sensible direction. Because of Youth Farm, um, I've learned lots of leadership skills and just kind of like all around life skills. Before this, I was hanging out in the streets, you know. I really didn't care about stuff like this, really. But then Youth Farm really changed my perspective on that. And I just feel like I, I really belong here. Youth Farm exists to use food as a tool for social change and specifically working with younger youth within a community to connect them to the garden. That's what I like about Youth Farm is you don't have to, the staff don't have to be an expert when it comes to the garden. The volunteers don't have to be an expert. We're learning this together. Maybe you don't come out of this being a farmer, but you'll come out of this being a, a better steward of your community, a better steward of this land, and a better steward to yourself. Growing of plants and the growing of people is kind of similar. At first it's kind of hard. After a while, once you are all working together for a common goal, you can really start to enjoy yourself. UFUN kind of opened that door for me to get to know more of my community and start shaping something that I wanted to do. Food is a gateway. A gateway to communities and to relationships. Community is everything. Youth Farm is important to the community because we give out we give back, if we have enough, we'll cook. When I come to Youth Farm, it feels therapeutic. Like, like it's a safe haven to, to, to work in. It makes me feel good seeing, seeing kids grow, seeing vegetables grow, seeing life change and, and grow with it.